the 3D printing nerd told me not to do this, but I'm gonna try it anyways. Well, technically he said he wouldn't recommend it, but I wanna try it out. I'm gonna try printing Ultim 9085 on my Bamboo Lab H2D. So Ultim or PEI requires a nozzle temperature of 350 degrees Celsius to 380 degrees, a bed temperature of 160 degrees Celsius, and a chamber temperature of 80 degrees Celsius. So the H2D can hit that 350 degrees Celsius nozzle, but other than that, it's just a bit below. So I'm interested to see if this actually works. I'm gonna try printing the same objects that the 3D printing nerd did. First up he did a pawn and then a benchy. And it looks like it worked. I'm gonna let this cool down for a while because it is still very hot, but it looks good. The pawn looked pretty good, so let's try the more challenging benchy. Well, it was technically able to print it, but clearly it did have some issues. There are some layer adhesion problems here. It was able to get hot enough to melt the material, but not quite hot enough to make it work properly. You can see as it went up, it kind of got worse. It was probably better near the bottom where the bed was hottest. The chamber temperature didn't quite get that hot, only 65 when it needs a little hotter. Ultim printed on the proper printer should be extremely strong. So that's why I'm gonna try it on my Vision Miner printer next. 